What's up, Home Slice? Lucas here. If I could go back in time, back in time to the school dance. First of all, I would have no shame showing up to the dance wearing nothing but this. I wouldn't give two ducks. And I'd learn these three dance moves. But you gotta focus. I wish I would have known these three dance moves back when I was in high school. Instead, I was that guy in the corner sitting there like this. That might have worked if I was a G or if I was an injured jock. <laughs> I was neither. <laughs> All right. All right, without further ado, dance move number one, okay? You don't wanna be the stiff standing there like this. You need to get in the groove. You don't wanna just start like freaking out like this or be that guy in the corner like this, you know? Easiest dance move to learn to just get you into that dance rhythm slowly, but also makes it look like you, you know how to move your hips. The side to side. All right, very easy. You, can, you don't even have to have any groove at first. So how this is gonna go, most dance music, most dance music at school is gonna be like or even the hip hop stuff like It's all one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's all you gotta know, okay? Cause that's all you gotta know for these simple dance moves. So all you're gonna do for the side to side is start like this, then you're gonna go out, and then in, and then back this way, and then in, and out, in, back this way, in. Now that's gonna be on the one, two, three, four. So, you know, one, two, three, four. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now, even if you do that all stiff and you're, you're, you're looking like, <laughs> At least you're moving, all right? It's gonna help you warm up, just get into the groove without like doing anything like, you know, like this, or like, you know what I mean? And it's just like, yeah. I'm guilty, I'm guilty of that, okay? That's how I know, all right? I want you to do this with me, follow along. We're doing the side to side. Ready, set, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now let's just like feel the groove. Just continue to do this. I want you to like feel the groove, all right? With your like arms, with your like head. You literally can do whatever you want. I mean, like just kind of like loosen up. If you just like loosen up, you know, it doesn't matter. It can look stupid, it can look silly, but when it's with the music, when it's with the groove, and this is easy because you can just like go in, like walk in like this. It doesn't matter, throw that arm down. And now you can walk around with this. Like, you can just like march around. Oh, get like that. This is the easiest thing to learn. And you can approach the ladies like this too. They're like, what's up? You wanna dance? Oh yeah. And then, you know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Guys, we are increasing the hype here, okay? And also increasing the difficulty just a little bit, but I'm confident. Any of you guys can learn this move, okay? This is when the music starts to get really pumping and you start to notice maybe like a circle form around. So you're doing your, you're doing your side to side like this, you know, and it's getting, it's getting more pumping, you know? But I mean, it's like, let's get more pumping. Yeah, you've exhausted the side to side. Okay, you're, you've been grooving for like 30 minutes. You're into the beat. What we're gonna do now is I'm gonna teach you guys how to do the running man. We're gonna take things to the next level, okay? Now the running man is a variation of marching basically but you're basically gonna be marching and staying in one place at the same time. Now I have multiple tutorials on how to do the running man, but I'm gonna share with you guys the easiest way to learn it right now, and if you follow along, you'll probably get it, okay? Okay, so real quick with me, we're just gonna march, all right, and I'll show you how to count this out. Ready? I want your right foot up. You're gonna go down. When both feet are on the ground, that's the one, two, three, four, okay? When you have one up, that's in the middle of each of those counts. So we just say and for that. So one and two and three and four. So that's boots and cats and boots and cats. So the boots, cats are the one, two, three, four. And then the ands are the ands. So ready, go. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one okay now
Now we're gonna do the running man. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna have your foot up just like this. You're gonna march down, but when you march down, you're gonna jump and toss that left foot backwards, okay? Now when, you, now when you come back up to a marching position, instead of marching up forward like this, you're gonna bring it all to the middle. And then you're gonna put the left foot down to kick the right foot back. And then bring it all to the middle. So it's just like you're walking, but you're not moving anywhere. Because you're shuffling that foot backwards and then shuffling it to the middle. The running man. If you pay attention really carefully, if you focus really hard, you can learn it right now, right here. Okay, so ready to count with me because we're going to do the running man. So we go one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one. Okay, sweet. So up to speed, we'll just say like one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. You can walk with your arms like this and you can turn with it too. All right. Ladies like this. You can do like an arm thing too. Like, oh, come here. Ooh. Come here. Yeah. Ooh. All right. So, uh, yeah. Move number three. People are kind of moving off the dance floor and and it's like only the hardcore people are left on the dance floor. And you wanna make your statement that night, okay? This is for the big dogs. We're gonna get down. Now when I say get down, I mean we're gonna do some breaking, okay? Yeah, straight up, all right? You should always take this off. Say, hey, hold my jacket, honey, I got something for you, all right? Man, you went from that nerdy kid to that cool kid with this one school dance because you learned these th three dance moves and you capped it off with this final move, the coffee grinder. This is one of those moves where everybody's gonna be like, dude, he can break dance. He's so cool, all right? And it doesn't take that long to learn. You're gonna get down, okay? Get on your toes a little bit in front like this. One hand in the middle, one hand to the side. This leg's gonna be out, all right? This is the one that's gonna be grinding the coffee. What's gonna happen is you're gonna swoop this leg around like this, jump over with the hands, jump up with this foot, put it down, continue to swoop around. All right, Boom. like that, see that? So, Kids at school, the jocks, the popular chicks, they ain't gonna know the difference between that and a flare, okay? So it's like, you could spend a year learning how to flare, or you could just learn that, if all you wanna do is like impress the girls at school, you know what I'm saying? So this is third and final move, the coffee grinder. It's a great get down. You know, you can also throw a butt spin, a back spin in there. I taught that in my other three dance move video we made last year. You can check that out too. You get a six dance move, check that one out, all right? <laughs> Easy. These are the three dance moves I would recommend learning this year for your school dances. I wish I would have known these. Man, I tell you, it would have made the dance a lot more fun. Probably would have gotten a lot more friends. And uh, yeah, would have had a better time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you want more Funky Fresh Fridays. Maybe we'll teach more dance moves every Friday. Let me know in the comments. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope this helps you all out, all right? Practice these moves. Let me know how it goes at your dance, all right? I wanna know how it goes. I wanna know if you tore it up, okay? I wanna know if uh, you know things went right, okay? Let me know in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe. More videos coming out. Peace, you all have a good one. I'll see you all in the next video.